Okay people, so I'm back out on the street for another day of exploring in Barcelona. I um, have been indoors all day and I'm starting to go a little too crazy. I'm heading to a, a fair called Biocultura, which is supposed to be, sorry about the noise, um, about organic, eco-friendly products and whatnot, so hopefully I'll actually find where I'm going and people are still looking at me like I'm mad but first a quick stop to get something to eat I haven't eaten all day it's after five going on to six and I am starving hungry like a dog okay so I found it he has the entrance and it was six euros to enter originally but I guess because it's the end of the day they have lowered half the price so I paid three of course, you all, I'm always happy to get a discount for whatever it is, whenever it is, pay less. Now, I'm going to go and look around and I will film any interesting stuff. There you go. Any interesting stuff and why did I speak to him in English uh, that I see along the way. Okay, so inside there were all kinds of different stands from organizations like Greenpeace to one selling incense and essential oils and holistic new age treatment stuff. Um, I couldn't stand staying around and watching everything because I couldn't focus, hadn't eaten so I grabbed a tuna sandwich and unfortunately I forgot that I, for I, I forgot that I had left my water at home and forgot to buy something to drink so now I'm trying not to choke on the bread. <laughs> if I survive, I'll show you a bit of a few of the stands inside. Um, so later. I cannot believe it. I'm here battling this sandwich made of dry, crumbly bread, and I see this man walking past me with what looks like a vegetarian burrito. It's a sexy looking dish. I hope for my sake that it is that food that is food that he got because he's a member of staff, and not that there's a stand filled with delicious organic food but I am here choking on this bread thank you Jesus I mean I'm grateful for the food but still I could have done better there is a stand I am very much disgusted with myself right now I am officially disgusted <clears throat> I walk in and the first thing I see is the stand for the goodies pastries and crap and I ate that miserable crumbly looking sandwich and look there's another stand with Dairy products, ice cream things. Oh God! I'm sick. I'm officially disgusted with myself. I'm crying, YouTube. I'm crying. I'm crying. <coughs> and you want to know why I'm crying? Look, I'll show you why I'm crying. Burritos and tacos and I ate that miserable sandwich to head home but before I do hey say goodbye bye biocultura that's the ground um, before I go home I am going to try and find a place where I can show you all the goodies that I got hey y'all so we're back where we began I'm sitting on the steps in front of the Olympic Stadium which apparently is what this building is and those of you who know me personally will not be surprised that my all my money went into food. So, starting with this stuff, 
shiitake, it's a shiitake mushroom paste, well spread. And I also got some tofu, which I will um, read online. Actually, I got some uh, little folder with some good recipes. So it's tofu primavera, and I'm assuming that um, the red, st oh, no, the red stuff is red peppers. There's also carrots. I also got this mix of seeds and nuts. At the same place, I was only going to get the pack of seeds, the seed mix. And uh, but the guy let me taste these caramelized um, with and chocolate coated pistachios, and they were so good. I just had to grab a pack to go with as well. I also got a bar of um, ecological. I guess organic chocolate with raisins. Mm. Yeah, I know I said I would not be eating chocolate and all that kind of crap while I was here and my bag has flown away. Oh, here it is. But I guess if it's organic, then it doesn't really count, does it? And finally, I remember the natural um, burrito place. Well, I'm so happy. Look at this, look at this lusciousness. Look at it, look at it, enjoy. It is organic, ecological, and that little red stuff is a lot of hot sauce. I can't wait to get home and put this in the microwave and have myself a little private party filled with nachos. I don't know if you can see very well, it is, it is cannabis beer. Cannabis beer, y'all. I told you guys I don't really drink, but I made an exception today.